All right, you guys want to know my opinion on East vs. West 3. No, really, you're asking, who the fuck is this guy and why do I care? Let me tell you, because I'm entering the arm wrestling, the world of arm wrestling, and I'm about to dominate. So guess what? East vs. West 3 was a, a great event, other than the fact that the live stream fucked up and lagged right after the fucking first match with... What's his name? I can't even remember anything. Who was the first match? Boom, first match, Michael Todd. Nope, that's the first match that came back. Fucking goddamn Derek Smith, dude. I popped the live stream on. Derek Smith gets up there and gets his ass whooped. Fucking disappointing as all hell, especially the fact that he's towering over this other guy. Shows you that arm wrestling is a very unique sport, ladies and gentlemen, and you never know who's going to win just by looking at the person. It's insane. Then the stream, right after that match, lags. And I was sitting there ripping my hair out for fucking 17 years trying to get the stream to go back on until the point where I got so mad that I passed out and fell asleep. Then woke back up at around 1.30 in the afternoon and fucking picked my phone up and then boom, I see Michael Todd ready to rip at fucking first round. And I'm like, holy shit, how many matches did I miss? Turns out I didn't miss any. I fell asleep and woke back up the second that the stream decided to resume. So I don't know how many matches people miss in general, but I know that the stream lagged out right after Derek Smith and came back right at uh, Monster Michael Todd. So we watched the matches. Monster Michael Todd almost fucking had it. There were so many 3-2 matches. It was insane. I just There were so many matches where we almost fucking had the win, and then we lost it. Like, Michael Todd almost had the win on that third fucking round, and almost... Actually, I can't even remember how that one actually went. It was fucking John Brzezink. What a crazy fucking... I can't even remember the details enough. I gotta go back and watch that shit. All I know is I did think that we were gonna do a little bit better against them. We didn't get fucking... They didn't sweep the floor with us, but we didn't We didn't sweep the floor with them, if you know what I mean. There was some back and forth going on. So I'm gonna have to go back and see what the total score was. But nonetheless, I'm very surprised that Derek Smith lost. I am surprised that they called the first pin for fucking Zurab when that was clearly an elbow foul. And I'm surprised that Michael Todd lost, to be honest with you. I thought he was going to fucking have that. That press that he got into to combat that Kings move and really just sit there and hold that shit until he had the moment to... That was amazing. Hats off to these Georgian dudes because they're something else. I don't know. Literally, this is what I was thinking during the live stream. What are they fucking eating over there? Why are they all so massive? Are they eating? What are they eating? They're huge. All of them. They're like giant fucking bears, man. And I want to arm wrestle them and get my arm snapped off. But this is Hundo coming at you with my thoughts. I'll let you guys soon. And uh, I'm going to be getting into the arm wrestling scene. I got my arm wrestling table on the way. I'm going to be getting my fucking practice in. Then I'm going to hit some local tournaments. And I'm going to become number one in Colorado. And then we'll go from there. So mark my words. Hundo's coming for these tables. Let's go.